Hey everybody, Cody here from Protocase back with another Proto Tech Tip. Today I'm going to talk to you about choosing the right length of stud and standoff for your custom enclosure or parts. So a lot of sheet metal designs require the use of a self-clinching stud or standoff. These fasteners are permanently inserted into a pre-existing hole cut into sheet metal using a PEM serter. They allow you to mount different components or brackets by way of matching thread, hex nuts, or screws. We've covered the basics of self-clinching fasteners in other Prototech Tip videos which we've linked to below. A very common usage of a standoff is mounting a motherboard inside of your enclosure. These are required to be raised up off the inside of your case which make these fasteners a perfect fit. So a standoff is inserted from the outside of your case and protrudes inside which gives your boards multiple raised mounting points to secure to. A common usage of a stud would be to mount something like a power supply inside of your enclosure. Most power supplies have mounting points at the back end which require the component to sit flat. Since this sits flat, the stud would protrude through your mounting point and it would be secured with a hex nut. But in order to make sure that your components are mounted properly, you need to make sure that you're choosing the proper length of stud or standoff. So let's hop onto the computer and I can show you how to do this. A very important thing to note here is that the length of a stud or standoff is driven from the base of the fastener to the top. Since these fasteners are inserted from the outside of the sheet metal, your material thickness will then take up some of that overall length. Example, if you have a 3 8 of an inch standoff being inserted into a sheet of 18 gauge or 0.048 inches thick metal, the top of your standoff is only going to be 0.327 from the inside of your case. This equals 3 8 of an inch minus 0.048. We often run into these issues with customer designs who are specifying components to sit up a certain height from the inside of the case, but are not taking into account the material thickness when designing around fixed length studs or standoffs. So make sure to keep this tip in mind when designing custom enclosures or parts with Protocase. I hope you found this video helpful and if you have any questions or comments please leave them below. Thanks and we'll see you next week.